Remote work is here to stay and will increase into 2023. Experts say data scientists at Ladders assert that the writing is on the wall, while some businesses continue to ignore the great resignation and demand that workers return to the office. Working remotely is here to stay. They predict that by the end of 2022, 25 of all professional positions in North America would be remote and that the number of remote possibilities will rise through 2023. Since the pandemic started, researchers at Ladders have been closely monitoring the availability of remote employment from the 50,000 top firms in North America. Before the pandemic, just four of high-paying employment were remotely located. By the end of 2020, that number had risen to nines, and it is now over 15. It is impossible to overhype this improvement in working conditions, the largest societal upheaval in America since the conclusion of World War IE, according to Ladder's CEO Mark Sinadella, is much bigger than people realize normally, hiring procedures to advance slowly, but the pandemic turned. Up the heat, causing a flood of change to occur quickly in this area. The consequences of burnout at work, the rate of job burnout increased to an all-time high as the year 2022, the third year of the pandemic. As demands rise, Companies need to concentrate on maintaining balance, taking items off the plate when they add something new. That's crucial in the healthcare industry because of the high attrition rates.